Well, here I am again. Hi to you whenever you are. Storms are brewing here in northeastern Pennsylvania. Enjoy, enjoy. I got my teeth out, see? No teeth. Ew. Yeah, great. Mostly all my age don't have teeth anyway, so who gives a sand? We replaced the F word with sand, so like Bernie Sanders is like to us as Bernie fuckers. Got some sand in your ass. I know this is silly. The energy is wild here. There's so much electricity in the in the air right now. You could hear the thunder, right? It's only like I don't know, six ish, six ish, seven ish, <laughs> two hours before sunset, somewhere like that. On one of the longest days, if yeah, it is one of the longest days of the year. I'm just moseying up here. You can see my little feet skedaddling along. I'm one oar. I'm not oar, and I just put the paddle away because I don't really feel like paddling. And my beer's still cold. I was catching fish down there, so I wasn't drinking much. I'm having a good time. My little fly is dragging in the water. Oh, isn't that cute? Yay! For some reason, the way, the way this is positioned, we usually get spared for a while. This is like the last spot to get it, if anything. But it usually goes around us. You like my finger, don't you? Oh, what? Hi, Valerie, Jennifer, Rose. Anybody caring to watch? I'll put this on the tuber. And uh, I usually don't take pictures and videos of fish this time of the year, only because the water's a bit warm, and uh, best to just not even bother doing that, out of respect. Uh, if I get a big one, uh, I'll find a way to get a picture at least, but now nah, we have enough people catching fish videos, right? It's not like uh, somebody landed on Jupiter for the first time or what have you, if you believe in that shite. This is like our water gauge here. <laughs> this poor thing's been washed around in circles for I don't know how long. Look at how big that tree is. They will be out there, flung around, spun around. But right now, this is about as low as I have seen this river, the Lehigh River, in mm, ooh, over, over five, six years. I have not seen it like this. I mean, this is... It's only like eight inches deep here or something. Ten, whatever. A foot deep, let's say that. Oh, here's the beaver lodge. But the beavers are gone, but they made a big thing here. And it just drops off, so you gotta, like, sort of go in the sticks to get through it. Because they, they made it deep here. Like, it gets really deep right there. You can't do uh, Shooter Shinola right there. And it gets deep. And, uh, oh, the greenery is just abundant. Vivacious. And if it weren't for the impending doom of lightning and thunder and downpours, I would stay here and fish. But I've done that before, and uh, it's okay. Fish aren't really going that crazy anyway. Ooh, there's a big bug flying on the oh, that's a dragonfly. A lot of big, that's a big dragonfly too. It looks like a helicopter. Can you see it? Can you see it? Can you see it? It's really nice. It's like 80 degrees. No sun. A lot of life. And uh, no strife. Uh, they're saying that it's going to be too hot in Georgia tomorrow for 
for uh, Sleepy Joe that he might start to decompose. So they might call it off. Yeah, who gives a fart about that, right? You can't change it. There's nothing you can do about it. Might as well get stoned and leave it alone. But it's all around us. I mean, really, it's hard to get out of those conversations. People think it's cool to, you know, bust, you know, like I just did. And, uh, yeah, it's funny, but really, in the end, the joke's on us. And they, they should all be on what's called Christmas Island. I still laugh from Max Egan, but there's some island off of the coast of Tasmania. And what he says is that we should just drop them all off there and give them a bunch of hammers so they can uh, do each other. Wow, look at the dragonflies. They're going crazy. That's neat. They're big. Wow, are they big. I wouldn't I wouldn't be impressed if I'd, I'd see this every day, but there's some something neat going on here. They look like hummingbirds. Look at the size of them. Holy crow. I'm going to just put the camera up. You see, they look like birds. Holy crow, are they big. Wow. Wow. They're like bats. Look at that one. Holy crow. Well, that's cool. I, I did a video. I mean, something cool happened. Look at him, wow, like a B-52 coming through. I hope the camera picks it up enough so it'll play on your phones. Wow, is that neat. I don't know if anybody even tries to fish with something that big. Look at that suck. Wow, wow. And they're inquisitive too. I don't think I've ever seen dragonflies quite that large. And a couple of them, you know, you see them. They're like bats. Woo, Nelly. Yeah, I'm in a V right now. It usually goes north, which is up that way. North is that way, actually. And south of this area first. And it, it's sort of like a V, and you can hear it coming. And luckily, I'm only about an eight minute walk from the truck. I don't want to be stuck like Chuck, like Bernie Sanders. Yeah, <laughs> go sand yourself. I don't have far to go. Look at somebody painted F FT on the tree, or Trump sucks. That's lovely. See what happens? People lose their minds. They just pick a political candidate over their own friends and family. It's really, yeah, man, you better off just getting stoned, chilling out somewhere. Especially when it's warm. I mean, just, ew. That stuff's all garbage and nonsense. Crazy. Hey, Val? Especially now. I mean, paying attention to it didn't change much either. But, of course, we're going to look. We're going to look. It is concerning, no doubt. What do we do to change it? Just act like nothing's going on. Everything's good. Slavery's good. Conscription's good. Getting taxed to death is good. They even have a, 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 a inheritance tax. Could you believe it? Those, uh, I don't even know what to call them. They're not real carpet baggers there. You know, just, and they get all these little fees and all these little monies all over the place. They're making money just from people taking a shark. Let's say you anti fart medicine, and people will go for it. Don't shart yourself today. Try some Bengay. Some anal Bengay. What's going to do that? Oh, yeah, suppositories. Could you imagine? That'd make your fart smell nice, huh? The Vicks. 
There, there's the first raindrop. I'm out of here, folks. I heard it. There it is. I'm into one. I got a raincoat. Good morning. Yeehaw.